everyone, it's Gidu. So if you hear any weird noises, it's because I'm weirdly perching on my seat. I've said this like every freaking video that I've done a flip through. So this is going to be a flip through of the Togenu no Chi. Uh, Togenu no Chi, I can't pronounce it. Uh, Nitro plus Chiral official works. So this is mostly, this is the front. I'm going to actually, I think I'm going to flip through through the back just so I can, oh wait, this side, uh, what? This one's upside down. There. Um, I might flip through it the opposite way just so I can uh, do it without uh, like a shadow shading the book. So this is Togena no Chi, uh, the first Nitro Plus Chirel art book. I am so confused as to how I'm supposed to open this. Oh, whatever. We'll just do it the right way. Uh, okay. Blech. So here is the front, which is just that rep around illustration. That's the cover. Uh, here is this. This is more just like sketches. And I mentioned that this is the first Nitro Plus Terrell game that they made. Uh, I believe it came out in like 2007 or something. I'm not positive. Or 2005 or something like that. So this is just a visual novel. Um, a very gay visual novel, mind you. Uh, I don't care as much for the main character in the series as I do for the main character in the other the other games that this company does. Specifically just because Akira is very... Akira is really uh, pathetic about everything. Uh, so this book is mostly consisting of just sketches and like, I don't know, before like not finished drawings of things. So it's like some sketches of some CGs. Uh, this is the only part that I just think it shows like mostly completed pictures. And that was like, see, it's like the concept art for this scene that ended up, this has ended up being the final one. Everybody has a bloody nose. I don't know why. Uh, and if you don't already know, if you haven't watched my videos before on Nitro Plus Trail stuff, my favorite character in this series is, uh, well, Rin and, uh, Motomi here. I love Motomi so much. Uh, and I also love Rin because he's very special and cute and not really innocent. But uh, here was the soundtrack cover. Uh, this is the one that they actually went with. I guess these are different variations that they were thinking of for the soundtrack. Uh, I am happy they went with the one they chose. I like it. I think it suits the the game very much. And these are all gloss pages. These are all like laminated. And then the rest of the pages are just paper. Uh, so it'll be nice because there won't be any glare. I... This is making me laugh because I don't know who that's supposed to be. Uh, who the hell is it? I don't know who that's supposed to be. Either Akira or... What's his face? And I can't remember it for the moment. Uh, that's Rin when he's like grown up. I love him. Just my favorite man right there. So these are very thin books. Um, I will link all of the other uh, Nature Plus Trail official workbooks, like the flip throughs I'm going to be doing in the description below. So you can take a look at all of those. Uh, they're all gonna be very similar to this, just for the different games. Um, and just in case you are interested, this artist is the same artist who does the art for Lamento. And Lamento is my favorite Nature Plus Trail game. Uh, so Shiki, that's his name. I hate him. I don't like Shiki. Uh, that's poor Akira right there, but that's Shiki. I don't like him. A lot of these, I feel like the anime focuses on Shiki. I haven't watched it, and that's kind of part of the reason I haven't, because I don't really give a flying fuck about Shiki. Did I, did I read this page? I can't even tell. 21. No, I didn't. Okay. So some nice designs. Keisuke, and the last one is Shiki. Uh, he's cute and also crazy, and I have trouble understanding whether I like him or not. And here is little Rin. And Rin, he's older. They never really say his age, so I really wonder how old he is in the game. Uh, here's Motomi. Old Man Bay. I love him. I love him. And his stupid face. I love him so much. I really liked his root. Oh, no, Or Ender, whatever the hell you want to come. Ah, I'm getting tired. 
I've already done. I've done so many videos today. <laughs> ah, that's what I do is I leave them and I wait. I think that's Genji. I think. Maybe. QR and Genji maybe. I don't remember their names. Don't ask. I also don't care. His tattoos are great though. His tattoos are great. He's really hot when he's not being a fucking freak. I think. Oh no that's just what's his face. I'm forgetting everybody's names. I haven't played the game in a while. Uh, at least two years. Sorry if I'm babbling. I'm getting tired. Ah. Ah. But yeah, see what I mean? Lots of sketches and whatnot. Uh, probably some sort of short story or like an interview or something. I think it's a short story. I guess of him and uh, Nano, which is nice. I didn't mind him as a character. Um, there's a few scenes that I, like, didn't like, but I guess it's understandable because he doesn't know how to treat people. I don't think I actually own, like, an art book of just Takano no Chi. I own, like, other Nietzsche plus Chirel art books that focus on all of them, but maybe I should buy one of just this one. I don't really care about Sweet Pool enough to spend money on that. But yeah, anyways, so I'll link the other videos in the description below. Um, I'll link all my social media and... I'm an affiliate with Tokyo Talk Tokyo Otaku Mode and CD Japan. So if you purchase those links, I get a small commission. So thank you very much. Uh, and one more thing about these is you can't... I think these are out of print. I actually bought these used. They were used, but they weren't really used. They were just, like, owned and put away and stored. Um, by another collector on My Figure Collection, which is also in the link in the description below for My Figure Collection. It's a place where you can... Uh, pretty much catalog all of the things that you own, all the things that you want to own, all the things that you've ordered, and kind of organize everything through there. And I do have my own account, um, and I believe I linked my account on there, so you should be able to go and add me if you would like. Um, and then you can see all the stuff that I own, all the things that I'm planning to own, or all the things that I've ordered, all the things that I have on my wish list sort of thing. Uh, but yeah, no, and you can find lots of people selling items on that site as well. I mean, it's up to your, it's your own risk, right? Uh, and you do it through PayPal, so generally PayPal kind of secures it. But for the most part, I would take a look on there if you're ever interested in getting these. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you all in the next video.